Good morning, everyone. Today's Monday, April 17th. I am getting ready to head over to the truck. I've got to take it into the dealership. Uh, boy, my car is dirty. There is pollen everywhere. So yeah, I've got to run over and get the uh, truck, take it into the dealership. Um, <clears throat> I'll show you when I get to the truck. But we were um, driving and smelled something burning and we were like, what in the world is that? Could not figure out where it was coming from. But it was very strong. And uh, I was driving, Don was sitting in the passenger seat and he had the seat heater on, on the passenger side. Well, he sits up and at the bottom of the seat, there is a burn mark right through the seat. So as you can see, the burn is right down there on the back part of the seat. And it does look just like a cigarette burn. Get a better angle here. Now we don't smoke. We don't cook with an open flame in the truck or anything. You know, we've got an induction cooktop and a slow cooker. So the only thing I can come to figure is the seat heater malfunctioned. Uh, I've never seen one do that or heard of one doing that, but that's the only thing I can come to conclusion. And uh, so anyway, I'm going to get the truck and take it in and uh, get them to take a look at it. They have to see the seat before they will order a replacement. So I'm just hoping I don't have any issues with them saying, you know, oh, it's a cigarette burn or something like that because we don't smoke or anything. And I just got a feeling they're going to give me a hassle about it, but we'll see what happens.
what's up everyone so today is Tuesday uh, we got dispatched yesterday on Monday uh, picking up Tuesday morning at 10 o'clock going from North Carolina up to Vermont and then uh, from there we were pre-dispatched uh, from Massachusetts down to uh, Pennsylvania so uh, today's Tuesday got up Tuesday morning got everything to the truck got to our pickup and the run canceled it happens so anyway we uh, waiting for our dry run status to come through and our dry run pay and um, back on the board and see what we get after that so Hopefully we get something good. We'd love to go west, um, even though we got stuck last time. But, you know, we always want the miles. We always want the big money. So, uh, we're going to hang out and uh, see what happens. Good morning, everyone. So, we've had a good time at home. Enjoyed our week off. Getting ready to get back in the swing of things. Um, back in the truck. Just got done uh, doing my pre-trip, so I'm getting ready to head out here and go pick up Don at the house. And then uh, we are heading down to our first run. So today is Wednesday, and uh, we're gonna be picking up in South Carolina and going to New York City. I hate going to New York City, <laughs> but gets us out of here, gets us back on the road. So uh, hopefully we can stay moving. But uh, we pick up today, um, and then we deliver first thing in the morning. And uh, you know, that area is a hot area, so hopefully we'll get something right out of there and uh, keep right on going. Hope everyone's had a wonderful week so far. Uh, the hours are starting out okay, I guess. And uh, we'll see what happens and goes from there. guys just stopped off here in Virginia to do my 30 minute break and uh, just got done eating some dinner heated me up some beef stew and uh, getting ready to pull out of here head on up we're on our way to New York City as you can see where I just stopped at the uh, Virginia Welcome Center uh, we've got some extra time on this run so uh, we actually got like probably seven hours extra and I'm thinking we're gonna get as close as we can and then stop and then go on in to New York City early in the morning so that way there's a lot less traffic and less people. So that's what we're planning, that's what I'm planning. Hopefully that works out. It's so much easier to go into the city, you know, at the two, three, four o'clock hour range than it is to try to go in there at like six, seven o'clock. So yeah, so I've got about three more minutes here on my break and then I'll be pulling back out and um, heading on down the road. So catch you a little bit later.
<laughs> the easier to remember. That's kind of like a specialty tag because everybody else don't have tags like that. I like the eight, so yay. <laughs> it's a good old. <laughs> it's a me, a Luigi. In the New York City. <laughs> it's a slice of pizza. <laughs> I like seeing pizza. That's like Chicago or something. Chicago pizza. Chicago's not going to be fish. I don't know. The big giant slices. I don't really like those either. New York, you gotta fold it over. Mm -hmm. Where's the car up there? I should zoom in on that. Cool Camaro. God, you're so, you're so slow. Took a wrong turn. Are we, is this going towards the bridge? Yeah. And we're in traffic. Welcome to New York. Welcome to New York. Eh? <laughs> you better not play that on the video. Well, you know I will. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just want to jump on here and go ahead and wrap up the video for this week. Um, we made it to our delivery up in New York City and um, then we drove down, um, stopped at a service center on the New Jersey Turnpike, set there Thursday, uh, Friday afternoon. We finally got another load, but it doesn't pick up till Monday. So uh, we decided to come on down a little bit closer to pick up, stopped at a uh, truck stop here. We've been at Love's all weekend. Just kind of hung around the truck, not really do much. But uh, we do have a run picking up Monday, so that'll of course be on next week's vlog. Um, also wanted to give you a quick update on the seat for the truck. I realized I forgot to uh, mention that earlier, um, but Freightliner did get back to us and they did determine that the seat heater did malfunction, uh, which we knew it did. So uh, now we've ordered a new seat, just waiting for that to come in. They said it could actually take like a month to come in crazy for just a seat right so uh yeah towards the end of may we'll have to get back to um freightliner there in north carolina and uh, have them install that but uh, yeah that's pretty much yeah we uh just been hanging around the truck all weekend not really doing anything uh just got done eating dinner and uh don's getting ready to do the dishes here as always as always he doesn't always do them. Yes, I do. But anyway, um, he's getting ready to clean up here, and I'm getting ready to start editing the video for this week so I can get up for you guys tomorrow. So thank you so much for watching and subscribing. We really do appreciate it. Hope everyone's had a great week, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care.